Welcome everyone. The first step to activate OK Google in the iPhone is in the App Store. Make sure you have the Google Assistant downloaded and you've opened it up and you can enter in commands with the microphone. Once you've done this, we are going to search for and open the Shortcuts app. Now, once we are in the Shortcuts app, we're going to tap on the plus and from here we're going to select add action we're going to scroll down and you should see hey google here if you don't tap on apps assistance and then hey google once we've done this tap on the arrow and show when run, turn this one off. Once ask when run is off, you're gonna tap on this arrow here and whatever this name says is the command you need to say for Google to activate. So let's rename to OK Google and then we're gonna tap on done. We're not done just yet. We're gonna need to open the settings and then we're gonna scroll down until we see Siri and search. So I think I'll scroll past it. There we go, Siri and search. And make sure listen for Hey Siri is on and press side or home button for Siri is on. So we need to say, Hey Siri, OK Google. What do you want to ask Google? What's five plus five? And you can see that's what you have to do. Now this may look a little bit janky, so what you may want to do instead is have the back tap where you double tap the back of your iPhone for the Google Assistant to activate if you don't want to ask Siri to ask Google. So what we're going to do is we're going to go into the settings and in the settings we're going to find where it says accessibility. We are then going to find where it says touch and at the bottom you should see the back tap and just tap on the double tap and scroll all the way down and just look for the OK Google there we go so now when we double tap the back of our iPhone you can see it brings us straight into the Google Assistant like that but one thing to note, if we go in, you can see it was a little bit glitchy there. It took multiple attempts for like the microphone to automatically start. So if we go again, you can see sometimes the microphone won't start and that may be a little bit annoying. So the app has to be closed for the microphone to begin listening, but this will also work if you want to use that as well. I'd recommend Siri to ask Google, but uh, with that being said, if you'd like to help support the channel, please do check the description. Bye-bye.